Hey everyone, it is Char from Char's Fascination. You may be wondering why I'm smiling so big. Okay. While I'm looking around my room, yes, that's a bag. Um, and, oh yeah, Rocco, I gotta mail that to you. That, that's a painting I did of this uh, cat in Philadelphia named Steve the Cat. Anyway, not going into that, Rocco. That belongs in your your RV. Um, but, okay, this is not what the video is about. Like, rich lux don't come at me for this, but I had to shut off your video to do this video. <laughs> okay. When I say something of mine comes up missing... And people better hope it gets returned because it's going to be stashed where I never had it. Now, if you guys remember the last couple of days, I said I need to find my paint, but I can't find it. And people better hope that I can. Somebody got scared. And this is a dirty bag, so you know it's old and it's ripped. This is not yesterday's bag. Okay, so this is an expensive fan brush. Now, I clean my brushes, so somebody had been using my brushes. I gotta clean these. Um, and uh, somebody had been using these. That's kind of obvious. So somebody had been using all of my brushes and when I mean all of them I'm even talking about all my ones from my old videos and when I told somebody in the house much all of my um, paint costs per tube and that it would cost me some more money just to replace them it's not necessarily money that I have. Oh, that's, that's my cheaper paints are in here. Okay, and then I mentioned how much it would cost to replace everything. Somebody must have gotten scared. I mean, look at all these paint brushes that reappeared. And I'm just showing you guys. And as for paints, these are practically like full paint tubes of Artist Loft paint. And I can tell somebody was using them because these are open. These are not, um, unless I closed them. Yeah, it looks like they did. Um, but these, when I go and look, at these anymore at Michael's are after tax ten dollars a bottle the basic I have bought these brand new and had never got to use them these are also ten dollars a tube I don't know why I said bottle they're tubes um, these are ten dollars a tube and these are not cheap mm -mm, this is not your cheap paint no, it is not. And somebody used up a lot of this one, so that's probably empty, really. This one's still full. Well, I think we all know that got used up. And then there's the brown. I don't think they really knew what to do with this color. I do. It's called trees. Look, like, I would never separate these at all. So, um, yeah, some scared person put my art supplies back because this is not the condition that I keep my paint knives in. And I would never put one in upside down or... This one looks like it's been melted a little. 
you see that. Now it's got paint on it. But that's... Like I said, somebody got scared. Somebody got scared and put it back. Used up all the white paint. That wasn't cheap. Oh my gosh, the black paint and the white paint are the most expensive out of all of them. I will tell you that. Um, so not cheap. But the point is, the point to this is, when people know better than to be stealing your stuff and they just shove it somewhere, make it look like oh well maybe you forgot that you put it there uh no i know where i put my stuff i found it where it wasn't um my next thing is fixing my sewing machine over there absolutely uh i will show you guys something that i started to do last night with the watercolor pencils out of what i showed you that I got yesterday but like I said somebody was seriously scared and they they used up a lot of yellow they used up a lot of yellow idiots just idiots like you know somebody's karma is coming I'll tell you that much this should be shutting because that paint is still wet Okay, I have a paint towel over there. I know what it is. It's the top of this. But I'm telling you, people's karma, some serious karma is going to hit them. And they took what was not theirs and realized, oh crap, she does account for those. Of course I account for them. I have a lot of painting to do and then I couldn't find them to get my painting done. I mean, for Christ's sake, I still owe Taser Urban X a painting. Um, Glitz, I owe him a painting. Look guys, this is the reason why I wasn't able to get your paintings done. Um, I should say your portraits is I was missing a lot of my supplies in order to be able to do it. So, now you know what was going on there. Um, and I don't really have the money right now to just try to replace everything, everything. And yes, I do keep some paint brushes up here with my feathers, but it's it's not the point. The point is, if you know it isn't yours, don't touch it. And you know it's not right to touch it when it's not yours because it belongs to somebody else. But anyway, like I said, I'll show you something I started doing yesterday um, with the water paints that I got. And they always say that you're not supposed to uh, be able to use water paint on canvas. Freaking please, people. Yes, you can. Indeed, you can. It's, I was bored. Um, I was really bored. And uh, if you want to know, yeah, I almost put a palm tree in there, but the senses were like, you know what? way to wait for a little while um will i use my other paints on here absolutely because that was my plan in the first place is if i could find my paints yellow would go in the middle um and if i still have any white left in any of the smaller tubes i can use it i mean this is my cheap ones from Five Below that I got like a few years ago. But whatever works, works. And whatever you can afford, you can afford. And 
not everybody can afford a lot. So I make do with what I have. Even if it is the cheaper paints. Like this is an acrylic. Guess what? This is a watercolor. And it's the tube water paints that you can really put on here. I use pencil, but you can really use the tube water paints on stuff like this. And I'm not even sure I have a white left. I'll look later. I mean, this was a white but I'd have to cut it open to get something out of it. But we'll see. And, uh, you know, people try to deter me from continuing to go forward. And obviously, people get scared of something and go ahead and put my stuff back. But why do you want to make yourself scared? when you can just learn to be an honest soul. And I'm just being serious about that. Why make yourself scared when you can just be honest in the first place? Be honest with yourself. Sorry, now I just feel like I'm in allergy season. It's warm, it's cold, it's warm, it's cold outside. So, um, yeah. I'm actually going to put some acrylic over this, over this water painting, and uh, I don't know, make it better, I guess. If you guys want me to show you how I do it, leave that in the comments below. But, uh, but hey, Rocco, you forgot Steve the cat. <laughs> well, actually, we both forgot. Uh, like I said, be honest with yourself instead of dishonest um, with yourself and other people. And I'll tell you what, that will not only make you feel better, but think of where your soul goes after everything. Where, where does your soul go? If you're going to continue to hurt people, your soul is not going to the bright place. Trust me on that. Um, the bright place. Talk about it because I've been there. Um, I just don't, I don't talk about when people have tried to murder me, but by the graces. Um, By the graces, <laughs> I'm still here. Uh, so, you know, really think about this. I started going through the one piece of luggage and was like, that's where I used to keep it. But then I glanced down like near my big canvases and I'm like, What's this bag back here? It was like, oh, somebody got scared because that bag wasn't there before. Somebody got scared and put my paint back. Used, mostly used up, but they put it back. Uh... That still leaves me to have to buy some paint, but not a lot. Um, yeah, you know, I really want people to think about that. Think about, you know, what you say on a daily basis that affects everything. How you treat people on a daily basis, how you speak on a daily basis. Um, about people or to people or about something um, that that really affects how people reflect who you are it really does that affects how people reflect how you really are um, and I would like to see more people being honest because quite honestly, 
I don't really feel that there's enough honest people out there anymore. It, and uh, if we all, if all of it, we honest people want to step forward, that's why I said we, I don't like to be a dishonest person, I love to be honest. Um, All of we honest people can step forward and say, you know, it's better to be honest than dishonest because dishonesty doesn't really get you anywhere. I mean, that's like selling your soul. Where does that really get you? you might think it gets you power, but you've lost your soul the moment you've done that. So, yeah. That's a lot of return to paintbrushes, isn't it? It's a lot of return to paintbrushes that I now have to clean. And trust me, this is not a cheap fan brush. No. This is like one Bob Ross would use. Which, quite frankly, you hold back here and take it and you can either stipple it up to make your branches go upward or stipple it going down and your branches go outward or you just go straight and your branches are straight. But to be straight and honest, Come on. They couldn't clean it. The evidence is there. The evidence is there from the guilty. So, I'm at least glad to have it back. I pretty much know who the dishonest person is, but I'm not going to say. For the sake of... I don't really care anymore. What does it really matter? What does it really matter? I mean, like I said, the minute I mentioned the price of each tube. Yeah, pretty much. Just want somebody to get scared. got scared. Gosh, I hope I have a lot of this left. I don't know. I'm hoping. So I have a lot. I have a lot that I want to do. I really do. I have a lot of teaching for artwork that I really want to bring out to you guys. Um, and that's, you know, just my way of thinking. Okay, now this dishonest person can just move along and be somewhere else. Just just be somewhere else. You, you're not needed here. You know what I mean? Um, that's probably how the, that person can actually deal with reality. And deal with... Uh, you tried to harm someone. Doing what you will. But in reality, and in a reality check, karma came back and scared you. And uh, the honest person that just like sat and thought, you know, I'll just have to save. Because even though Michael's Crafting is having to sell for $1.99 or two, which by the way, I can still not find. Um, then, uh, you know, it, it depends on if I would have a ride back to Michael's. You know, it would depend on if I had a ride back. It would be cheaper to do that than order it and then have it shipped. Um, yeah, absolutely. So anyway, guys, 
I really want you to stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed because what's in here that makes you think something isn't always good for what's in here? Please remember that. Stay positive and always remember to put the right foot forward so that your soul does not get left behind. Have a blessed day.